身。I didn't hurt Messi. I didn't. Please trust me. Don't pretend to be innocent. At that time, there were only your handbag and your fingerprint. You're still denying. I didn't. Not not to Messi. Shut up! Servant told me that you were not at home that night. You went to the Chin family and made trouble with Chin Chi. Then Chin Chi went out home out of anger. Not long after that, she had an accident. No. Then that she made she ask me to come back to see family, and I went back home after I took the seeds. Don't pretend to be innocent. I have evidence. Because of this accident, May she became disabled. She has to use artificial leg in her life. You're so malicious. I will send you to the prison to atone for your crime. New one, nineteen o three. You were suspected of causing serious injury to traffic accident. Formally convicted. Now you're under arrest. Sentenced to five years in prison. Immediate arrest. I beg you, I beg you, I beg you, stop! I tell you what, Mr. Fu had told us. He doesn't want to see you coming out alive. Continue. He'd hurt your dad. Fucking shit. You, you are so cruel. Number nine four one three. You have reduced the penalty. You can be released now. Tisha, you have found the truth, right? Truth, you murderer. If it's not because Mei Shi needs your bone marrow, you can never be released from prison. She has various degrees of serious injuries, severe anemia, and malnutrition. As her condition now, she may be in danger if her bone marrow is extracted. I don't care. Tishan, do you hate me that much? Tishan, if if she's not suitable now, I can wait. No, your leukemia can't wait. If it's not the accident two years ago, you must have been cured already. You don't even need to suffer so much. Ning Wei is to blame. He must atone for you. Don't stand here. Do the operation. Release me! Release me! Release me! She doesn't need anesthetic. Quick! No! Release me! It's not enough. One more. But she can't bear it. Stop. Stop. Oh, you are awake. You, you didn't use my bone marrow. Surprised. Actually, my leukemia has been cured already, but Tisha didn't know. He still remember my operation day. Oh, by the way, he said that you must give your bone marrow to me. Qin Meishi, my mom has worked for the Qin family for so many years. I have also respect you all the time, but just because I married Fu Tingshen, you started to hurt me again and again. Your mom and you are bitches. I just want you to die. You. Why do you treat me like this? Monsieur. Bitch, you dare to push me, Monsieur. No, I didn't. 
and just fell by herself. My foot hurts. Mama, you also want to make my dear other leg disabled? Don't say that. You will be fine. Nua, now that you didn't realize your fault, I will send you to prison again. No, no, no! Release me! Release me! Where am I? Have you forgotten your home after two years in prison? Nua, now that you didn't realize your fault, I will send you to prison again. No, I will never go back to the hell again. I don't want her to die. I don't want her to die. Don't run. You feel scared now, right? Let's divorce. What? I say, let's divorce. Nua, it's you who made a real effort to marry me. Now you want a divorce? Impossible. What do you want to do? Do you think that I will make love with you? You are so dirty. I don't know how many men have fucked you. You don't deserve. Fortisha, you are the only man I made love with. Come with me. Release me. Why do you bring me here? Your food made me ill. What fucking restaurant? I beg you, please stop. You taste your food. Taste your food. Go to find some money. Take out some money. Don't rob my money. Your money? It's my money. You must pay me. Mom, mom. Be patient. The best is yet to come. Fatisha, I beg you. Don't make trouble with my mom. You can come at me. Look, if you divorce me, your mom will live this kind of life. Stop! Police! Police! Release my mom! Your mom? Huh? Your daughter? Then you can just use your body to compensate for your mother's fault! Let my daughter off! Let me go! <coughs> Show what? Mom, show what? What are you doing? Stop! You are lucky. We will be back. Mom, stand up. Oh, mom, are you okay? Someone reported that you are doing illegal business. No, we'll confiscate your your gun and guns. Close the store. It's impossible. It's impossible. I have been lured by the other way. Mom. Miss Fu, it's time to go home. Xiao Wan, Mom, Xiao Wan, let me off, let me off, let me off. Do you know, my mom has a heart disease. She can't be irritated. She's your mom, not mine. What does it have to do with me? It's her fault to raise you to be such a bitch. Fatisha, I beg you, let my mom off. I'm willing to do whatever you want. Whatever? Two years ago, you broke Mishi's leg. Now, break your leg. Fatisha, you are so cruel. Since you're not willing to do it, let's forget it. Well, as long as I break my leg, you will let my mom off, right? Of course, but you must be quick. Your mom can't hold on anymore. Is it enough?
小碗。我听说。If you don't love my daughter, why did you marry her? Why? Is this still not enough for you to hurt her like this, Mom? Mom, don't. Show her. Sir, you're not supposed to come in. If she dies, I'll let the whole hospital be buried with her. Don't worry, sir. We'll try our best. The cord cannot be connected at the moment. Do you find out where anyone is, Mr. Shu? Miss Ning has been sent to the city hospital for rescue. Go to the hospital now. Yes, sir. Mama. Mama. Ah、uh、ho! -huh. You come back. I've just come back. I heard you had an accident, so I came. Doctor said your leg was broken. What happened? Did Fu Tingsheng hurt you again? It's in the daytime. You should be careful while having an affair. What are you talking about? How? I'm okay. You can go back. How? It's so intimate. Which lover is he again? Don't say that. How and I are just schoolmates. Why? Why? If you want a divorce, I can help you. Divorce? You still want a divorce? It seems the punishment was not enough yesterday. What kind of fucking restaurant is this? You taste your food. Taste your food. Is it enough? Sorry, how? I want to divorce, but I'm not able to do that. I can't drag you down. How? I don't plan to divorce now. I want to rest. You can go back first. Mama, are you sure? I can help you. You can believe me. Enough! It's my business. I don't need you. That's right. Be a good Miss Fu in Fu family. Don't think of any other thing. Got it? Wang Wang, where are you? Mr. Fu doesn't tell me where you are. Mom can't find you. Mom. I'm okay. Don't worry. How can I not worry about you? Mr. Fu treats you like that. It's my fault. I shouldn't have cut Mrs. Fu's last wishes. I made you marry him. Mom, I'm Mrs. Fu. I won't suffer. Ting Shen and I just had a quarrel. Don't worry. Does the shop reopen yet? The shop is open, and no one come over for trouble anymore. But I worry about you. These are all what I got in change of my daughter's suffering. Mom, don't worry. I'm okay. I'll come back to visit you. Fu Tingsheng is dead in writing. If he trouble my mom again. It will be terrible. I have to buy a job quickly and save more money. Mister Fu, Lord Fu's tumor has gotten worse. His eye is in a daze. There's little time left. How long will my grandpa live? It's only half a year. You should get ready for the worst. Grandpa. Ting Shen, where's Ning Wan? Why doesn't she come with you to visit me? Grandpa forgot Ning Wan was in prison before. 
Grandpa, new one is sick. She's in the hospital. Is new one pregnant? It's great. I just want a great grandson. Grandpa, new one hasn't been pregnant yet. Alas, Tinsa, don't let me down. I have wished for so long to have a great grandson. Only one wish. I got it. I want a great grandson. Yes. Mrs. Newton, the wound in your left bone is too serious. You'd better have more checkups when you have time. As for vigorous sports such as running, you should avoid them as much as possible. Okay, thank you, doctor. It's okay. Take a good rest. <laughs> What are you doing? Taking you home. Do you think we still have a home? After you left, Grandpa had a serious illness. He doesn't have much time to live now. What? I don't want to take you back, but he's in the trance. He's always thinking about you. Grandpa, you finally come to see me, Wawa. I thought you two had a fight. Grandpa has forgotten a lot of things. Grandpa, Tishan and I have always been fine. Don't worry about us. That's good. Grandpa is relieved. Last night I was lecturing him. You two have been married for half a year. I really want a great grandson. Grandpa, I plan to have a baby with one one. Hey. <laughs> Fortishan, why did you promise Grandpa? I only agreed to marry you. I didn't want to be a reproductive tool. Don't forget, you are Mrs. Fu. It's your responsibility to bear children for the Fu family. How did Qin Mei Xi give birth to your children? Don't mention Mei Xi. You don't deserve to compare to her. Right. I don't deserve to be compared to her. You are so great. Why did you ask her to give birth to your children? Let go of me! Let go of me! Let go! Let go of me! Let go! What are you doing? Let go of me! Let go of me! Let go! Fu Tingshen, don't you think I'm dirty? Yes, you are dirty. Listening. We are from the legal department of the Singhai Hotel. I saw a resume, but you didn't graduate from college. You can only start as an ordinary worker. Please think about it. Ah,、oh, okay. Hi, I'm here to check in. All right, get to work. Pick up all the rubbish on every floor. What? I come here for a legal department. Why does my work have to do with picking up rubbish? Everyone who doesn't graduate from college has to start as a cleaner. If you can't take it, get out. You bitch! Your mom was the cleaner in my house. How dare she sleep with my father? How dare she sleep with my father? From now on, anyone who dares to be your friend is against me, Qin Mei Xi. Okay, I will do it as long as you pay me on time. Miss Ting, I have followed your instructions. I have arranged Ning Wan to pick up rubbish.
Hey, are you the new cleaner? You're fucking pretty. Don't be afraid. Sleep with me. If I'm satisfied with the service, you won't have to do such dirty work anymore. Let's go to my room. Sir, behave yourself. Hey, are you playing hard to get with me? I love that. Let's go, baby. Mr. Fu, what's wrong? Come on, go inside. Ah, that is our new cleaner. Cleaner? I thought she's the hooker. Offering services in the hotel. How dare you seduce me at all? Hey, you damned girl! Fu Tingshan. Oh, first day on the job. You have started offering services? Ning Wan, I think you are here looking for a sugar daddy. No, I'm not. What a bitch! Our hotel has no love for fairs like you. Get out! You are fired. Manager, it was that man taking advantage of me. Ning Wan, are you that cheap? No. I'm not. I'm not a hooker. Since you like to seduce men, I give you enough at once. Let go of me! This woman, you can have fun with her tonight. You'd better kill her in bed. No, Fatisha, you can't do this to me. I'm your wife. Wife, if you hadn't framed me, I wouldn't have married you. Cut the crap. Serve my man well. No, please don't, Fatisha. Don't do this to me. The more you scream, the more excited we get. Mister Fu said tonight you're a plain thing. Hey, come on, baby. Get away! Get out! Get the fuck out! Stop pretending pitiful. This is exactly what you like, isn't it? Fatisha. I work here decently. I just want to make money. You want money, right? Come here, please me with your body. I'll give you money if I'm pleased. I give you a chance to make money. You don't want it. You only like making dirty money, right? I didn't. I say I didn't. Don't touch me. Don't forget that we've promised Grandpa to have a baby. Sorry, the number you dialed. Sorry, the number you missed him. Mister Fu took Ning Wan away just now. He looked very angry. You said Ning Wan was taken away. Which room is she in? Sir, I don't know what you are talking about. You are telling me we're right. I'm going to make a complaint about you to the hotel. Hey, don't, please. I can tell you, she's in three or four. <laughs> This Ning Wan messes with men everywhere. Fu Tingshan, did you bully Ning Wan again? Sheng Hao, we are a couple. This is just a game between us. Will you stick your nose in this? How? Are you okay? I'm fine. 
Paul, are you okay? I'm fine. You care about this adulterer so much? Fu Dichen, get off Niwa. You know what? I and my wife, we just finished the great sex. Now she's still exhausted. Shen. Shen Hao is innocent. What? Are you afraid I'll hurt him? If you are obedient and get pregnant with my baby, then I will spare him. <laughs> it seems that you are willing to do anything for that adulterer. Let's get started. Now you're so active, but only turn me off. We had sex for several times in hotel last week. Why am I still not pregnant? You still haven't got pregnant? Useless loser! Maybe... Maybe it cannot be tested yet. Better be. Why are you here? Tishan, this Sunday, my family is holding a birthday party for me. I want to invite you and Ning Wan. No problem. We'll be there on time. Where is Ning Wan? Ning Wan, I heard that Lord Fu is serious ill, and he has always wanted a great grandson. Are you pregnant? Ting Shen, I'm just concerned about Ning Wan. Why did she ignore me? May she is talking to you. Stop acting. I don't need to care. Ning Wan, your mom couldn't find a job at that time. It's our Qing family who took her in, so she could bring you up. Technically speaking, our Qing family is a benefactor. How can you treat me like this? Mom, tomorrow, our school is having a parents meeting. Have you asked for a leave? Tomorrow is my birthday. Hurry up and go prepare it. Miss, I, I'd like to take a day off tomorrow. A day off? Who wants if you take a day off? Get out of here if you don't want to work. Our Qing family doesn't hire losers. You dare to glare me. I'm gonna punish you. Benefactor. Monsieur! Niwa, may she cares about you. You're ungrateful and even pushed her. I didn't push her. Niwa, may she cares about you. You're ungrateful and even pushed her. I didn't push her. How dare you talk back? Nisha, don't be angry. Niwa, she didn't do it intentionally. Tishan, if Ning Wan can't get pregnant, do you want to consider trying with me? We'll talk about it later. 
I'm sorry, manager. Yesterday, I. What are you still doing here? You are fired. Manager, please, please give me another chance. I really need this job. Well, as long as you can sell one thousand bottles of wine tonight, I will keep you. Sir, we have some new beers here. Would you like to buy some? Of course, but you have to accompany me. I'll take as many bottles as you drink. Sir, you misunderstood me. I'm not a barmaid. Oh. So you come to sleep with me? You should tell me earlier, baby. Come on, let's go to the room upstairs. Let's go. No, I'm not a hooker. No, I'm not a hooker. You? Who the fuck are you? You even dare to hit me? I'm your fucking father. How?、Oh. Come down. I still have to work here. Work here? Bastard! Wait for me. Wait for me. What a mess here! If you really want to go to work, you can work as a lawyer in Shen's group. I don't even graduate from college. How? How can I be qualified to work in your company? I'm a manager now. I've got some rights. You can be my system first. Yo, Ning Wan, I don't think you are here to work. You are here to ruin my business. You don't want to work again, manager. No, I will sell the wine now. I'll pay for all the drinks here tonight. How? You can't do this. You can't help me like this anymore. Good luck to you. Get up work today. How? I will pay you back for the drinks tonight. Wawa, why, why are you so polite to me? I can't believe Mrs. Fu comes out to work just to have an affair with his daughter. Fu Tingshen, what are you talking about? Don't you like to seduce men? Come on, let me check if you've improved in the past few days. I don't need your money. What? So you have just been satisfied by the adorer? Don't you want it now? You. I was given a job of selling alcohol. Is that what you think? Go out and see your selling wine, but not your body. Let's see if anyone believes you. Get out. You, what do you want to do? Do you think Tingshan would let you have children with him, when he knows you have sex with others? No, don't. Qin Meixi, are you crazy? If I'm crazy, it's because of you. Fuck this bitch! I'll give you a big reward. 
No, no, don't! What's the matter, Niwa? How? Oh, I'm being chased. Let's go. Niwa! 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 You two losers. Can't even contend with a woman. Has Mrs. Fu come back yet? Not yet. Fu Tingshan, how dare you come? Get out. Doctor, how is my wife? Her leg bone cracked for the second time. Now she needs to be operated as soon as possible. But after the operation, she may not be able to walk normally. If you accept the result, sign it. Fu Tishan! You bastard! You bastard! How come? You don't know! If it wasn't for your trusted approval, would she make she hurt anyone? You know what? When I saw her, I thought she was dead! Fu Tingshen, do you have any humanity left? Huh? What did Niwa do wrong? She just married you! And you? You put her in jail yourself! And now you want her dead! Qing Mei Xi? What does she have to do with it? I knew you'd defend Qing Mei Xi. Remember... I would definitely help Niwan. Leave you bastard! Shen Hao, you are just a lawyer. How dare you go against me? For Niwan, I'm not afraid to give my life. This is hospital. Please be quiet. Monsieur, did you go to the Xinghai Hotel tonight? No. I have been at home all day. I didn't go anywhere. Tishan, why are you asking me that all of a sudden? Nothing. Have a good rest. Bye. Bye. Give me all the civilian cameras from Xinghai Hotel. Find out who did this to Niwan! Kill these two punks. Got it! What? Afraid of me? My leg. What's wrong with my leg? I can feel it. You've lost your leg. What do you mean? Fu Tingshen, are you satisfied now? You thought I caused Qing Mei to lose her leg. But now I'm giving it back to her. But have you ever thought that I never bumped into her at all? 
I didn't. Why are you doing this to me? You're in a bad mood now. I'll arrange a psychiatrist for you. I don't need a psychiatrist. I just want to make it to get retribution now. Don't be crazy. Two years ago, Macy suffered much more than you. Keep an eye on her. Got it. Tingsheng, Sunday is my birthday party. Don't forget it. I remember it. What are you doing now? What do you think, Monsieur? I always thought you were a simple, kind girl. But why are you becoming more and more of a stranger to me? What do you mean? Do I need to tell you what you did tonight? I don't want this to happen again. Niu is my person. Only I can touch her. Put it on. Come with me to Meishi's birthday party. Take me. Aren't you afraid I'll match the venue? You don't have the guts yet. Who said that? Dolls can jump over walls when they are forced to hurry. Be obedient to me. Can my leg recover if I'm obedient? Do you have to be angry with me? You disgust me first. If you don't want to go, I'll take you there. Aya, Miss, how do you work? You are ruining my jets. What a lowly servant! Do you know how much my jets cost? Can you afford it? I'm sorry. I'll clean it for you. Don't get your filthy hands on my jets. I've got a dirty jets, so you'll have to pay for it. The jets isn't dirty yet. I didn't get it dirty, Miss Ting. The jets is still clean. How dare you question me? If I say pay me back, then do what I say. I'm sorry, Miss. I'll pay you back. Do you think a thousand yuan is enough? One thousand yuan? My jazz is one hundred thousand yuan. What? What an eyesore! One hundred thousand yuan. Qi Mei Xi, that's enough. Xiao Wan, Mom, stand up. Xiao Wan, what are you doing here? Why are you in a wheelchair? Yeah. Who did I think it was? So it's the daughter of this lowly servant, Mom. I'll take you away. I can't. Mom said I can't yet. I have to work here tonight. If I leave now, I have to pay for it. Mom, we don't make dirty money here. Who are you calling dirty? I say you. If you have anything, just come at me. Don't insult my mother. Well. Then you'll pay for it for your mom. Don't you have money? Tishan, look, this servant. She got my dress dirty. It's my birthday tonight. Isn't that a bomb in my interest? How much is this skirt? One hundred thousand yuan. My mom didn't stain her dress. Niwa, if you kneel down and call out to me, she, I'll pay you back this money. What did you say? What? Are you unwilling? Then pay back. Xiao Wan, it's Mo's fault. Get out of here and let me alone. Is it okay, Niwan? Why do you kneel? I was just kidding. 
You are already disabled. Doesn't that make everyone think I'm only a disabled person? Well, I'm going to cut the cake first. Since you can't feel your leg, anyway, no matter how long you kneel, you have no feeling. Let's go. Show one. It's mom's fault. Mom shouldn't come to Chi's house for work. I let you down. Mom, it's none of your business. Even without you, Chi Mei will also embarrass me. I got you into trouble. Hey, who's this? What a disappointment! There's such a dirty thing on Miss Ting's birthday party. I heard it was her mother staying Miss Ting's dress. So she's kneeling here and apologize. Oh, I see. That's an inferior person. Mom, get out of here. Leave me alone. Hurry. You stain Miss Ting's dress. You slut. Miss Ting is minded. How can people like you to stain her? How dare you! Xiao Wan! Xiao Wan, wake up! Who told you to touch her? Xiao Wan! Xiao Wan! Xiao Wan! You are a bunch of losers! Who told you to do it? I'm sorry, Miss Ting. Well, Mom. Does Ting Shen like Ning Wan this lot? It's my birthday today. How could he leave me with Ning Wan in his arms? I'm so humiliated. Calm down, Mei Xi. Except Ning Wan, that stinky girl. Who does Mr. Fu care about the most? Lord Fu, why did Ting Shen marry Ning Wan? It's because of Lord Fu. I didn't hit me, she. I didn't. Believe me. We. How do we become this? Niwa, don't make a fool out of me. And don't play pathetic with me. Rounds. Bad 7262, you. Are you Ning Wan? Do you know for a upstairs? He's my grandpa. What's wrong? He's starting to lose his mind. Always talking about Ning Wan, Ning Wan. You are his family. Why not go to visit him? Okay. Miss Ting, it worked. Grandpa. Why, why? What happened to your leg? Grandpa, I'm fine. I heard a nurse say you are always talking about me. I'm sorry. It's been a long time since I've come to see you. <sighs> I'm an old man. You young people are busy. I'm the only idler. I'm used to it. Tell me, what happened to your leg? Did Ting Shen bully you? Just tell Grandpa, I'm gonna beat up this stinky asshole. No, Grandpa. I just... Fell accidentally. It's okay. <sighs> well, well. I know. After you married Ting Shen, you suffer a lot. 
I have a bad memory now. But I can see. You are not happy. Grandpa, I never regret marrying Tishan. The doctor is looking for you to talk about the patient's current condition. Okay. Grandpa, wait for me for a while. Okay. Nurse, do you make a mistake? Grandpa! Fell asleep. He was in conspiracy just now. Ah! Grandpa! Grandpa! Grandpa, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with Grandpa? I don't know. I have only been out for a while, Grandpa! Doctor! Doctor! Grandpa, don't sleep, Grandpa! Open your eyes and look at me, Grandpa! Grandpa! The patient is gone. No, it's impossible! I was talking to him just now. He was fine. I don't have a grandpa anymore. <gasps> Who came here today? It seems that only Miss Ning. Fortician, are you doubting me? Mwah. Grandpa doesn't owe you anything. Why did you kill him? I didn't. Grandpa was so good to me. How could I kill him? You let go of me. Tisha, what are you doing? Let go of Ningwan. Let's talk this out. Hurry. What are you doing here? It's been a long time since I came to see Grandpa. How's Grandpa? Grandpa. Grandpa is gone. What? How could it happen? Tisha, I didn't kill Grandpa. I didn't. Ningwan, I know you're annoyed because you can't have a baby. But even so, you can't kill Grandpa. He's Tisha's closest family. Have you considered Tisha's feeling? I say I didn't. Tisha, please believe me. Call the police. Grandpa's death. I'm not going to let it go. Does Grandpa's death have anything to do with Qing Meishi? Tishan, I didn't kill Grandpa. Grandpa was so good to me. I have no motivation. Listen to me, Tishan. I didn't kill Grandpa Tishan! What are you doing? Come on, get off! Come and clean the toilet! Quick! Oh my god, how could she be so weak? Well, let's go, let's go! For Tishan. I didn't kill Grandpa. I didn't. Why don't you believe me? Why is there so much blood? Oh, 
You're finally awake. Where am I? I'll bait you out. You're pregnant. What did you say? Pregnant? You're pregnant for moss. Why is it that this time I'm going to have a baby? Why, why? Now Fu Tingshen is convinced it was you who killed Lord Fu. Are you sure to give birth to this baby? No. I didn't kill Grandpa. I didn't. I believe in you. But Fu Tingshen doesn't believe you. He's the one who sent you in the jail. Twice! Do you know there would have been a chance to cure your leg? Now it's gone! Niwa! Look at you! What you suffer now is caused by Fu Tingshen! But what can I do? It's not easy for this kid to come. I really don't want to give up my baby. Niwa, you resist me so much, it turns out to be pregnant with Sheng Hao's baby. What the hell are you talking about? Petition. You won't even admit your own child? My child? You and Sheng Hao are so intimacy. Who knows whose baby is? You! Mr. Sheng, do you have anything else? If not, get out. How? You go back first. Fu Tingshen, Ningwen and I are not what you think. For you, she already lost a leg. You can't ruin her baby either. You care so much about my wife. Then I ruin your baby. Fu Tingshen, it's your baby. Why don't you believe me? Drag him out! Yes, sir! Fu Tingshen! Fu Tingshen! You son of a bitch! How? How? Call the doctor. Arrange her to have an abortion immediately. Yes, sir! Fu Tingshen. It's your baby. We got him with a hard time. We can't abort him. Absolutely not. Firstly, the child in your belly is Sheng Hao's. Secondly, you killed my grandpa. I definitely won't let you give birth to my child. Fu Tingshen, and now that grandpa is dead, you don't want this baby. Let's get divorced then. From now on, the baby will be mine. What did you say? I said, let's get a divorce. Niwa, I told you. I'm going to torture you for the rest of your life. You can't escape in this life. Keep an eye on her. Tisha, Niwa is now pregnant, released on bail. Are you going to let her go? Of course not. I'll send her in jail with my own hands. I'm just afraid you'll be fooled by her and forget about Grandpa's death. But Ting Shen, Ning Wan, is she really pregnant with your child? That baby's Sheng House. How dare she cheat in marriage? Ting Shen, you must divorce her. You are too good for a murderer like her. When we're done with the baby, I'm going to divorce her. Ting Shen, Will you marry me? Grandpa just passed away. We'll talk about it later. Mom! 
that bitch Ning Wan, she's actually pregnant. What? I can't let Ning Wan give birth to the child. Otherwise, Fu Tingsheng won't divorce her. <laughs> I know. Fortunately, Fu Tingsheng has always thought that child is not his. Tomorrow morning, Ning Wan is going to have an abortion. Fu Tingsheng once loved Ning Wan deeply. Is he willing to do that? Why should he be unwilling? He believes it was Ning Wan who killed Lord Fu. He wishes her to die. Will he still care about a bastard? Please, I don't want to have an abortion. Please, don't worry. Mister Sheng has taken care of everything. We are not going to operate on you. Really? Yes. Is it Sheng Hao? The patient's surgery was a success. She needs to have good rest during this time. She cannot be overtired. Fu Tingsheng, are you satisfied now? Take a good rest. Remember, you can only be pregnant with my child. Otherwise, I beat you up if you're pregnant with one. You may rest assured. In my life, I will never have our baby. Keep an eye on her. Yes, sir. My child, you need to be safe. How? What? Ningwa is missing! Bunch of losers! You can't even control a woman! What are you waiting for? Go and find Ningwa! If you don't get her back, you're done! Yes, sir! Hello, the number you have got is turned off. I've already taken her away. Don't worry, she's Mrs. Fu. Fu Tingsheng won't turn a blind eye on her. Sheng Hao, what are you doing? Why did you tie me up? Wah Wah, I'm not gonna hurt you. I just want to contend with Fu Tingsheng. Fu Tingsheng won't care about me. You're trying up the wrong person. Well, I can test whether he has feelings for you. How? So you keep my baby? Is it just to take advantage of me? Mama, I don't want to take advantage of you. But I'm from the Shun family. I I have to do it. After Fu Tingsheng gives me the project, I'll let you go. Are you going to use me to threaten Fu Tingsheng? Fu Tingsheng doesn't love me at all. There's no way he's going to give you the project. Liu Wan, I have no choice. It's all I can do now. The Shun family is now at the end of their rope. I need this project to come back from the dead. What if Fu Tingsheng doesn't agree? What are you going to do with me? Well, I will pay you back for keeping my baby. We are not friends in the future. Wawa, I'm sorry. No, no. Mr. Fu, there is news about Mrs. Fu.
Mr. Fu, are you looking for Ning Wan? Where's Ning Wan? I'll call you. I don't ask you to pick her up. Mr. Fu, I want your Binghai project. Give it to me. I'll send Ning Wan back to you. Binghai project is Fu Group's 100 million project investment. We have been planned for five years. Give it to you. If you disagree, then don't think about seeing Ning Wan in your lifetime. What are you waiting for? Track Shenghao's location! Shenghao made a shield. There's no way to locate it. No! Mr. Fu, what is your answer? I can get you involved in the project, but I definitely won't give it up. What's more, just because of one new one, you dream to pin me down? Then I'll make a bet. If not, even if she ends up dead, I don't care. <clears throat> Niwa, trust me, I won't hurt you. Recently, I contacted one hospital from abroad. There is a well-known professor of orthopedics. After Shun's group got the project, I'll take you to have a treatment. Do you think I will go with you? Will you be with Fu Tingshen? He treats you like that. Let's contend with him together. Isn't it good? Don't you hate him? I do hate him. How could I not hate? I lost my leg. And I almost lost my baby. How could I not hate him? I'll find a way to help you get divorced. Then we'll go abroad together. I'm sure to cure your leg. Do you think I'm going to believe you? Moreover, I know what kind of person Fu Tingsheng is. Even if I run away to the ends of the earth, he will get me back. I'm not afraid. I'm not going to let him find you. What a touching scene. A little lawyer. Dare to take away Mrs. Fu? How did you get in here? Bunch of losers. Try to stop me. Fu Tingsheng, there's nothing to do with Sheng Hao. Punish me if you want. Well... At this time, you're still pleading for this man, right? Fu Tingsheng, are you a man? You keep holding on to a woman! Wan Wan! Wan Wan! Are you okay, Wan Wan? Didn't you miss Carrie? Will it be that man's child? Fu Tingsheng, how could you be so cruel? I have your baby in my belly. It's yours. You really want him to die? Wawa, 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 Wawa! Call the ambulance! Fortunation, please, please save our baby. Please, as long as you don't let me abort, you can ask me to do whatever you want. It's true. Didn't you abort? It was my idea. Don't blame her. Without my permission, you can't have anything wrong! My baby, where is my baby? Don't move. You're still weak. Fetishan, tell me. Did my child die? Tell me! 
It's not mine. It doesn't matter whether it's dead or not. You want to hit me again? Fu Tingsheng, my leg, my baby. What else do you want to take away from me? I'll give you whatever you want. I'll give you all. Okay? Tell me, what will it take for you to leave me alone? I said it. I'm going to torture you for the rest of your life, Mr. Fu. You told me to get in touch with Professor Orthopedics at Board. It's already in the South City. Let him come here. Mrs. Fu, this is a well-known orthopedic surgeon, Professor Zhang Yan. What did Fu Tingsheng want to do? Isn't it enough to break one leg? Does he want to break the other? That's not what Mr. Fu means. Mr. Fu wants to cure your leg. Is he so kind? Come here, Ms. Niu. Let me check your leg first. In this situation, there's still a chance to cure your leg. But Ms. Neil, if you want to stand up like before, you need a strong will. You will feel more painful in the future treatments. Can you stand it, Doctor? She has a strong mind. She can、Mrs. make it. All right, let's start treatment tomorrow. What exactly does Fu Tisha want to do? Mr. Fu just wants to cure your leg. Well. Cure and then break again, right? Does he think playing tricks on me is really fun, right? I'm sorry, the user you are calling is not available at the moment. Please try again later. Shang Hao, he always ends my calls. Xiao Yang, do you know how Shang Hao is now? Mrs. Fu, it's okay for you to ask me about this, but don't ask Mr. Fu. Will he? Mr. Shou is fine. He's just busy with his company affairs. Xiao Yang, thank you for telling me this. In fact, Mrs. Fu, Mr. Fu still cares about you very much. If he really cares about me, do you think he will kill our baby? It seems that you are recovering well. It seems that you are recovering well, slick girl. If you want to know about Sheng Hao, just ask me. Can you let Sheng Hao go? Let go of the Sheng family? It depends on your performance. After curing a leg, what we haven't done before, get them done. Maybe, I'll say yes. What did you say? The child is gone. We'll have another. Fu Tingsheng, you finally admit the child is yours. But I will never give birth to your baby in the rest of my life. It's not up to you, Niuan. You are destined to be my plaything. If you don't give birth to my baby, I will shut down your mother's shop and then tear down Sheng Hao's company. Let's see who's the winner. You are crazy, Fu Tingsheng. You are such a pervert. You play me. You even use a lot of money to cure my leg. It's good that you know. So, have a good treatment. Doctor, Doctor Zhang. I, I can feel pain. A、oh, little girl, this is just the beginning. You'll feel more painful later, but for the sake of life in the future,、mm. hold on.
Little girl, continue the treatment for another month. You can try to walk. Mom, if we don't take actions, Ningwen's leg will be cured. Tingshen, how could Tingshen so soft-hearted towards her? My baby girl, now the most important thing is not Ningwen the bitch. It's how you get for Tingshen's heart. Right, I can't afford to mess myself. Mom, I only want to marry for Tingshen in my life. Well, for Tingshen doesn't divorce Ningwen. He even found someone to treat her. We can only use force. Mom means. Uh... Mr. Fu, since the project is finalized, let's have a toast. Mr. Zhou. Let's go. Mr. Vo, we leave first. Tishan? What are you doing here? It's been for a long time. We don't even have a good drink together. This time, I must let you leave Ningwan. Come and marry me. Mei Shi, why are you here? Ting Shen, you called me yesterday, said that you were drunk. Let me come and pick you up. Then, you brought me in. We had sex? Yes. I'm sorry, Monsieur. I was drunk last night. You don't have to apologize. Last night, I was willing. I have liked you so many years. I don't regret it. Monsieur, I don't want to hurt you. But I have no feelings for you. Except marriage and love, what do you want? I'll give it all to you. But, oh, I want is you. But, oh, I want is you. Don't you still like me, Wan? Don't forget. She's the driver who hit me, looted my leg. What's more, she killed Lo Fu. I remember all these things, whether I like her or not. Meishi, I don't want to hurt you, so I won't marry you. You. Mr. Fu, are you dating with Miss Ching? Mr. Fu, what's the relationship between you and Miss Ting? How long have you been dating? 
Mr. Fu, it's said that you are married. Are you blatantly cheating? Shut up! If you dare spread rumors, wait for a lawsuit from Fu Group. Madam, Dr. John told us that you can go home and recuperate. You come for acupuncture every week. I pick you up from the hospital. Madam, Mr. Fu was drunk last night. The news can't be true. Never mind. I won't be angry for trivia. To tell you the truth, he and I are a fake couple. Is it it? Mr. Fu, I've took Madam home safely. Are those news all pressed down? The PR department is already dealing with it. It will take some time, and Madam has known it. I got it. Teacher, have you seen all the reports on the internet? Look at what they have done! John Mei Shi, how could she be a mistress? It was our Mei Shi. She was a fiance. You did it for your mother's last wish, so you marry Ning Wan. Now it has made me feel wrong for Ting Shen. Although you are the president of Fu Group, you can't bully her like that, can't you? That's right. You know that. Me she has been waiting for you for so many years. This time, you have to give me an explanation. Get divorced and marry my daughter. Otherwise, I won't let you go. Mr. Che, Mrs. Che, I've already told me she very clearly I won't marry her. As compensation, I'll invest Ching's group 10 million yuan. 10 million yuan? No, no, no. I don't want money. I want the happiness of Mei Xian. Attention. Back then, when you accidentally drowned, it was Mei Xian who saved you. At that time, you promised to marry Mei Xi when you grow up, but so many years passed. How dare you say a thing, but make a set for us? Over the years, I give you Qing family about 100 million. This kindness, I remember it all the time. It's almost paid back. Let's go back. Where's Niwa? She's in the loom. Niwa! Niwa! Mr. Fu, this is the key. Niwa! 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 Why are you here? Niwa, without my permission, you're not allowed to die. What the hell are you talking about? Who wants to die? You're not trying to kill yourself? I'm just taking a bath. Well, you think I saw the news about you and Ting Mei Shi had sex in the hotel? I will not be able to stand the rumors. Rest assured, I have been used to affairs. Get out of the way. The news are not true between I and Meishi. It's because... You don't have to explain. I don't care. Do you have anything else to do? I want you to rest now. I just left the hospital, and my body hasn't recovered yet. This is my room. Qing Mei Xi didn't satisfy you. You still want to sleep with me, but I'm on period today. I can't accompany you. Your period is at the end of the month. It's just the beginning of the month. Don't touch me, Fetishian. Get out and find Qing Mei Xi. Go to fuck her. I never touched her. Go out! Enough! Niwa, don't force me. I tell you what, when I want to sleep with you, just spread your legs obediently.
Ouch! It hurts. I'm in so much pain. You're bleeding. The patient's vagina was severely torn. Miss, is he really your husband? Do I need to bring out my marriage certificate? You had better be. Doctor, we're husband and wife. You just give me the medicine. Means, if domestic violence occurs, it must be reported promptly. I'll be right back. Xiaoyang will send you back. I need to go back to the company. You don't have to tell me about your stuff. And I'll take a taxi back by myself. I don't need a driver. Yuan, will Fu Tingshan marry me after your death? Qin Meixi, what do you want to do? You just stand up. Fu Tingshan really put a lot of effort into you. Qin Meixi, you will be punished for doing so many bad things. So, tell me what I have done. How dare you intimidate me? I haven't got even with you for Lord Fu's death. Lord Fu was killed by your own hands. What does it have to do with me? Why are you pretending to be innocent? I saw you at the hospital that day. So, it was not just me who appeared in the world. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't slander me. I didn't go to the hospital that day. Really? I didn't mistake it. Don't talk nonsense. It seems that you'll only be quiet when you are dead. How? Call the police. How? Are you okay? Monsieur, why did you hurt anyone? I... I have been running down lately. Those... Those journalists are blocking my door every day. They scold me that I'm a shameless mistress and I loan your marriage. My parents even came it out. I really can't control myself, so I went to finding one. I didn't mean to hurt her. I really don't want to hurt her. This is a certificate issued by the hospital. Miss Jin has been feeling uneasy lately. She's suffering from a serious mental illness. Sometimes she doesn't even know what she does. She's really innocent. If she has to be sent to prison, she might not be able to live on. I'm sorry, Meishi. It's all my fault for not protecting you well. Tisha. Aren't you angry with me? How come? Don't worry, I won't send you to prison. Fortunately, you came up with a solution. Ning Wan, that slut wants to sue me? No way. How? You... why are you doing this? You are... I heard you had a miscarriage. I'm sorry. I haven't been able to save your child. It's over. And this was not your fault. Perhaps this trial came at a really bad time. No. It's all my fault. If it weren't for threatening Fu Shen, I wouldn't tie you up to Shen family. And you wouldn't have a miscarriage. This time, let me make amends. Don't worry. Jimmy Xi intentionally hurt you. We would definitely prosecute her to the end. Niwa, let me she go. She didn't mean to. Fu Tingshen, if it were not Sheng Hao's help, 
What you are seeing now is my corpse. Qing Mingxi wants to kill me. Do you still want me to let her go? Aren't you okay now? But she will definitely go to prison for her crimes. Shouldn't she go to prison for intentionally injuring me? Lu Dingzhen, don't go too far. It seems that the Shun group has not been chaotic enough recently. How dare you have the energy to touch my woman? Fu Tingshen, Sheng Hao saved me. He's my savior. Don't touch him. If you want me to leave him alone, then withdraw the charges against Mei Xi. Impossible. Over my dead body. Well, Ning Wan, this is what you asked for yourself. How oh, I'm sorry to get you involved. It's okay. Fu Tingshan has been targeting the Shun Group recently, but there's a mysterious investors come to help us. The current Shun Group is not something he can bully. Really? When have I lied to you, Mama? I will definitely strive to become stronger. I will protect you from not being bullied by Fu Tingshan again. Xiao Wan, can you come back? I'm in trouble. Xiao Wan, Mom, didn't I just pay half a year's rent last month? What's going on, Xiao Wan? Just now, just now, the proprietor said that our store was acquired by the full group. The rent has increased fivefold. I can't even rent this store if I can't pay the rent five times the rent. Where can I find the money? Fu Tingsheng. Well, Ningwa, this is what you asked for yourself. Fu Tingsheng, you really can't do anything for Qin Mei Shi. Fu Tingsheng, Fu Tingsheng, he hurt you so much, you cannot come to him. Mom, I haven't divorced him yet. Don't worry, I'll handle this. No, I would rather not rain the shop. I won't want you to back him. But the story is a lifelong effort. I won't let Fu Tingsheng ruin it like this. Mom, you go back first. Xiao Wan, Xiao Wan. Fu Tingsheng, I can spare Qin Mei Xi, but you must return the store to my mom. Fu Tingsheng. Is this how you come to me for help? I beg you, the breakfast shop is my mom's only livelihood. She can't survive without that store. What does it have to do with me if your mom can't survive? I mean business, not charity. I promise you, I won't go after Timmy's crime anymore. She won't go to the jail. You promise me now. It's too late. I beg you. What do I need to do for you to return the store to my mom? Well, it depends on how far you're willing to go for your mother. Is this enough? Niwa, be smarter in the future, and make a clean break with Sheng Hao. Clear? I got it. Xiao Wan, the owner called me. He said the store can operate normally now, and he will not increase the rent. You, are you okay? Mom, what could possibly happen to me? I'm Mrs. Fu. Even if Fu Tingsheng dislikes me, he won't do anything to me. But, Mom, I'm tired. I'm going to have a rest. Come here, Niwa. Don't make me say it twice. Are you ready? What? Your vagina. No, not yet. 
Do you know the consequences of lying to me? I'm ready. Good girl. No. You want me to close your mom's door? No, please don't. Then please me. Aren't you good at seducing men? Why are you pretending to be innocent with me now? I'm not. You've done it many times with Shengha, right? Fetishian, that's enough. Hello, Wama. Wama. Let your daughter hear how slutty you are. Fucked by me. Wama, what is the speed? Wama, Wama. 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 Ah. Mrs. Fu, dear sir, Mr. Sheng also looking for you. Let's him in. Wawa, well, well, I know it was Fu Tingsheng who forced you. I'll take you away. If you dare to piss me off again, it's not just your mother's door, but your mother disappeared together. How? I'm married to Tingshen. Why should I go with you? Wawa, well, uh, what are you talking about? Did he threaten you? Tingshen and I are fine. We just had a little argument before, but we are good now. You don't need to worry about me. And don't come to visit me anymore. Please leave. Let go of me! Do you mean that? I'm sorry, Hao. I do not deserve your kindness. Now, leave me. You will find your own happiness. Oh, what do you think? From the beginning to the end, I just took advantage of you. I just wanted Tishan to care more about me. Now that I have achieved my goal, you are no longer of any use to me. I don't believe it. I'll take you away. I can help you get rid of Fu Tingshan. Tishan, I have been released without charge. Can you come and pick me up? Great, I have something to discuss with you. Mm. Stay at home obediently. I want to go to work. I don't need your money. When I give you money, you must take it. Don't go out of work. It will disgrace the full family. Oh, my dear daughter, what's wrong with you? Why are you vomiting so severely? Could it be that you are pregnant? Pregnant? It seems I haven't had my period for two months. I may be pregnant. If I'm pregnant, I will attribute it to Fu Tingshen. 
Let's go to the hospital. Hey, Ting Shen, I'm feeling a bit unwell. I need to go to the hospital. Let's go. I'm pregnant. This baby comes so timely. Ting Shen, you are here. I am pregnant. I'm going to be a mom. Baby. Whose baby is it? He must never find out the truth. The father. Of course, it's you. Last time in the hotel, have you forgotten? I haven't. Ting Shen, aren't you happy? Actually, I'm not very happy either. This baby, he comes at a really bad time. Your wife is Ning Wan. Even if this baby is born, it's also an illegitimate child. How could I possibly let him become an illegitimate child? Actually, Monsieur. Don't worry, Ting Shen. I'll get an abortion. I won't cause you any trouble. I'll be right back. My dear daughter, is Fu Tingsheng still not willing to divorce that bitch? Mom, Fu Tingsheng is hesitant. Even if I'm pregnant with his baby, he won't divorce Ning Wan and marry me. No way, Ning Wan, she must die. Do you need to do these kind of things by yourself? Don't worry, Mom. I won't do it myself. Baby, you haven't come to see me in a long time. I've missed you so much. Chen, you don't even know that bitch Ning Wan. She's been kicking on me all the time. Who dares to bully my baby? I sort it out for you. Are you serious? Yes. As long as you're happy, I'm willing to do anything for you. Tian, you're so good to me. Then will you marry me, Monsieur? As long as you're willing to marry me, even the moon in the sky can get it for you. Tian, I'll consider it when you kill Ning Wan. Okay? Okay. Deal. Mr. Fu, Mrs. Fu went out to buy something just now. And she's missing now. What? Didn't I tell you not to let her go out? She insisted on going out. I don't dare to go against her wish. Hello, the number you dialed is pulled off. Check Ni Wan's location for me. Let go of me! Let go of me! Shut up! Hey, bitch! Someone's offering a lot of money. They want to bury you alive. Stop fighting! Let go of me! She's a good-looking girl, isn't she? She's going to die anyway. Why not screw her first? No! Don't come any closer. Get away from me! Get away from me! You're on the verge of death, and you're not obedient. You'll enjoy later. Please, please! Shut up! What the fuck? Shut up! Hurry up! Someone's coming. Don't, don't touch me. Well, how much did they pay you? I would double it. No, five times. Please let me go. Money? We don't need money. We just want to have fun today. Let go of me. Someone's coming. Ting Shen, Ting Shen. It's okay. Don't cry. Get down! Get down! 
Tell me. Who asked you to do this? Uh, buddy, no one asked us to do this. We just saw this beauty. And wanted to arrest her. I don't have time for the bullshit. Did Timeshi put you up to this? Timeshi? She wouldn't do such a thing. Beat them up! Beat them until they confess! Yes, sir! Hello, boss. Fu Fudi Jin is here. The plan failed. What? Fudi Jin? How could he be there? Don't you guys know to do it more secretly? Well, a bunch of junk. Huh? Don't leave. I'm not in the moon, Feng Tian. If you don't kill Ningma for me, don't think about making love with me. Okay, okay, okay. Baby, I would definitely help you. It's just that Fu Ting is eyeing on this thing now. So I have no idea about this. Alright, alright. I'll distract him then. Mr. Fu, Mrs. Ning hasn't eaten anything today. Give it to me. Don't come over here. It's me. Eat it. I don't have an appetite. I don't want to eat. You have to eat even if you don't have an appetite. Don't force me to make trouble to your mother. I'll eat. Eat slowly. Don't gobble it down. Mr. Fu, Miss Ting is coming. Tishan, I have already made an appointment this Sunday. I'm going to have an abortion. No need for abortion. Let's keep the baby. Though, I'm also reluctant to let this baby go. Instead of letting him hide it from everyone, I'd rather be cruel now. I will marry you. What? Ah. Uh, Qin Mei Xi is pregnant. Fu Tishen. Why exactly am I to you then? Why exactly am I? Tishen, are you serious? I will immediately share this good news with mom and dad. Then, should we go for a prenatal checkup together tomorrow? I'll pick you up then. Mm, I gotta go. Mr. Fu, those two punks finally spat out the truth. Their boss is a man named Feng Qian. He's an all-rounder in black and white. He runs a real estate company, but behind the scenes. He's actually a gangster. He has no grudges with Ning Wan. Someone must be behind this. I'll keep looking into it. It's just that Feng Qian's whereabouts are uncertain. It's not easy for our men to track him. Let me know as soon as you have any news. Where are you going? Where are you going? Since Ting Mei Xi is pregnant, I think you're going to divorce me, then marry her, so I have no reason to live here. Don't you forget you almost had an accident last night. I think I will be safe when I'm not with you. I'm already looking into the abduction. These days, you just stay with me. What about Xin Mei Xi? Don't you afraid she'll be jealous? After all, pregnant women need a good moon. Even if I marry her, I still want you to stay with me. You asshole! Ning Wan! Fu Tingshen, you are going to divorce me and marry her. Now, you want me to be a mistress? You insult me! How could you treat me like this? Because you're jealous of Qing Mei Xi. You almost killed her with a car, and you killed Grandpa. Ning Wan, it's a sin you deserve to atone for. You're never gonna get rid of me! I told you I didn't. Shut up! 
Without my permission, you're not going anywhere. Let me go. What the hell are you doing? Chase her! Sir, please go to Wai Road. <laughs> Sir, please go to Wai Road. <laughs> Sir, stop by the side. I want to get off. Sir, stop the car. <laughs> Someone's trying to kill you. You're gonna die tonight. Stop the car. Baby, I killed that woman for you. When are we getting married? Get married? You are dreaming. I'm going to marry Fu Tingshen. You are just not good for me. It's... You're kidding me! It's okay for us to have a sexual relationship. But we can't get married. Ximizia, what do you take me for? I... Calm down. I'm carrying a baby. I really... I still believe you? <laughs> it's true. I'm carrying a baby. You have sex with me, but you didn't have sex with others too? I don't know whose bastard this kid is. Don't blame it on me. Today I'm going to show you the punishment of offending me. Miss Ching, you are suspected of an attempted homicide. Mr. Fu, I got it. The person who Feng Qian contacted most frequently is Qin Mei Shi. How could it be her? How could it be Qin Mei Shi? <laughs> On Central Avenue, an accident happened early this morning. One dead and one wounded. Damn it. Niwa, you can't be dead. A patient named Ning Wan was just sent to the hospital. I want her alive. If something bad happens to her, I'll take you whole hospital with her. The patient suffered severe brain injury. She can hardly wake up. Her family should got themselves all psyched up for this. Niwa, open your eyes. I haven't tortured you enough yet. You can't die. Once you wake up, I'll never torture you. I let you go. <laughs> Mr. Fu. How's it going? The car involved was seen at Qing family. I suspect Feng Qian arranged the car. Qing Mei Shi is the initiator. Hello, I'm the attorney agent of Ching Mei Shi. Miss Ching wants to see you. Tishan, I'm innocent. Please help me. I'm carrying your baby. You're not gonna let me go to the jail, aren't you? How long have you messed with Feng Qian? Feng Qian? Who is Feng Qian? You're still denying! You colluded with Feng Qian and kidnapped a new one a week ago. You wanted to bury her alive. Three days ago, you asked Feng Qian's men to kidnap Ning Wan again, but he had a car accident. Tishan, Tishan, I didn't, I didn't. It's Ning Wan, that she slammed me again. Qin Mei Xie, 
I had substantial evidence for these things, but you're still denying. It turned out that all along you got me screwed up. Tishen, Tishen, I don't know what you're talking about. What else are you hiding from me? Tell me everything. Two years ago, about the car accident, didn't anyone strike you? So you haven't been using your prosthetics. There's nothing wrong with your leg. Well, well done, Chimishi. I've been cheated by you for so long. Tisha, that's not true. I was hurt seriously in that car accident. I just didn't have my leg amputated. I'm not gonna trust you anymore. Tisha, Tisha. There's one thing I didn't lie to you. This baby is yours. But you don't want your baby to be born in prison, right? Niwa, wake up. Or pound your mother's story into paste. Don't you care most about your mother? You need to wake up right now for your mom. Where am I? Niwa, we're in hospital. You were in a car accident. Do you forget about that? Car accident. You? Who are you? I'm your husband, Fu Tingshen. Fu Tingshen? Who is Fu Tingshen? Do I know you? Why doesn't my wife remember anything? She just wakes up. She suffers a severe brain injury. Probably she has a memory loss. When will she get her memory back? It depends. Some people can't get the memory of the other day, but some people may have a long time. Niwa, hold on me. I'm your husband. Everyone say a couple will have telepathy. Why do I feel like you are such a stranger? Do you have a photo of us? Just let me have a look. If we are a real couple, how come you don't even have a picture of us? You did lie to me. Have you seen clearly that I am I your husband? How could this be so fake? Isn't it a composite picture? By the way, so what if you are my husband? Maybe we plan to get a divorce before I lose my memory. It's the right time for us to get a divorce. What did you say? Divorce? I tell you what, it's impossible in this lifetime. Fu Tingshan, Mama is not willing. You don't force her. None of your business. Get out! What Mama wants to do is my business. Mama, where do you want to go? Let me give you a ride. Mama is my wife. Why should she go with you? Alas, stop it. I'll go back myself. Mama! Yes. Where are you going? I... Where is my home? There's a car behind us, do you know? Excuse me, sir. I'm not going to get on the car. I don't remember where my home is. Bear in mind, our home is Fuyuan. You are seducing me? I don't think. Get out of the way.
Are you working here? No, my mom was here. I come over to help her. What's your name? My name is Ning Wan. Ning means peaceful. Wan means good night. Ah, uh, Tishan, there you are. I've been looking for you for a long time. I remember you. You... you stay away from me. This is my loom. Get out. You know what? We're a couple. We should sleep together. Couple? I don't remember you at all. Is it okay? You... you are a rogue. Voila! When did you get your memory back? Two days ago, at that time, I started to get foggy and remember something from my childhood, and then it all came back. So, Fu Tishan doesn't know that? That is unnecessary. Tell me, how is this thing going? This man named Feng Qian kidnapped you twice. He's actually Qing Mishi's paramour. And Qin Mishi has slept with him for times, so he has been helping Qin Mishi do a lot of things. Is there any proof? Don't worry, you can count on me. This man Feng Qian used to being a bully on the street and doesn't know how to do things quietly. I bought off a few boys and they told me everything. I've given the evidence to the police. Before long, they will arrest Feng Qian. Unfortunately, she's still at large. I don't think Feng Qian would cover up Qin Mishi. As far as I know, before Qin Mishi was imprisoned, they had a big argument. Feng Qian is not an idiot. He must know that Qin Mishi just took advantage of him. I hope she can be convicted this time. She has done so many bad things and even killed Lord Fu. But I'm worried that Fu Tingshan will continue to bail her out. After all, she was already arrested a month ago. But Fu Tingshan still managed to bail her out as a means. Fu Tingshan is going to marry Qin Mishi. Of course he will bail her out. And she's pregnant. Pregnant? I have investigated. Feng Tian and Qin Mishi have a lot of checking records. Do you think this baby might not be Fu Tingshan's? Who cares? Anyway, I decide to get a divorce with him. Mr. Fu. Miss Fu met Sheng Hao in the morning. Oh, Mr. Fu, you have a meeting! Cancel it. Why did you meet Sheng Hao? Sheng Hao is my friend. Why couldn't I? Let go of me! Let go of me! What do you want? Let go of me! You! Fu Tingshen, I don't want to go to the hospital again. I'm over you. Is this funny? You've got your memory back. Yes, I remember everything. I remember that Timacy got me into a car accident, and you helped her to skip bail. I handle that, but not now. I don't want your explanation. You want to fuck me? Go ahead. Mr. Fu, Fun Qian was arrested just now. If he confessed about Miss Qing, will we still put a bail for her? If that's for sure, I won't. But she is pregnant. Her kid is not mine. That's Fun Qian's. Mom, Mom, what should I do? Fun Qian was arrested. Will he disclose me? Tishan didn't trust me at all. I don't want to be arrested. This asshole it seems to be an arrogant and domineering person. But actually, she's a coward, my dear daughter. You should go abroad for the moment. Does it mean I can't be with Tishan anymore? Life is important. Go. 
Miss Ching, you're related to two kidnaps. Go with us. Mr. Fu, Miss Ching has been arrested. Fen Tian disclosed her. And one more thing. What? The kid is... Is Fen Tian's... Xin Mei Xi! How dare you! Xin Mei Xi is related to kidnap. It's confirmed. Sentenced of 10 years. Are you satisfied? What? You don't want me to protect Xin Mei Xi. No, she is sentenced. No matter what you want to do. I don't care. Really? Or not? Absolutely. Her kid is not mine. I didn't sleep with her. Don't explain to me. I'm wrong. What did you say? It's my fault to trust her, and I misunderstood you. Ningwa, I'm wrong. Fu Tingsheng, if you do think so, then let go of me. Let's divorce. Yuan, don't compromise this time. Thanks. Help yourselves. Hey, son. Give me a corn. Hey, son. I want a fried dumpling. Okay. Wow. Fu Tingsheng, why are you here? I... Xiao Wan, Tingsheng said he didn't come to visit me after you got married, so today he's here. It's busy here, so he comes over to help me. You don't need to work. I want to help my mother-in-law. Please go back. You will do a disservice here. Don't you see the business is better with my help? Save it! Huh? Well, are you okay? Sorry, everyone. We have no food now. Please come tomorrow. Mom, didn't we just get started? Although you jumped on more business, but you hardly come to visit me. So, I want a break too. Didn't you plan your divorce? What's going on now? Mom, there's no divorce thing. We're good. Xiaowan, I hope that Mr. Fu can divorce me. Mr. Fu, could you let go of my daughter? You treated her so badly. We don't have much money, but nobody can hurt my daughter. Mom, I was wrong. I won't be like that again. Trust me. Fu Tingsheng, I don't love you. What did you say? I don't love you. So stop harassing me and my mom. Wang Wan, go and clean away the dishes with me. Mr. Fu, you are not going to force one one again, right? I have signed a divorce agreement and left it with Fu Tingsheng. Once it is signed, you will be completely free. Niwa, are you out of work now? 
Why don't you consider working for me as a legal counsel at Shengshu Group? I haven't even graduated from college yet, you know. Moreover, a company as big as Shengshu won't want a woman who has been in jail. I'm the boss. What I value is your ability, not your background. Besides, I do help you to help me. How? I will think about it. Thank you. Wang Wang, welcome to Shengshu Group. Well, has Fu Tingsheng signed the agreement? I haven't received it from him yet. I'll give him a call now. Sorry, the number you've dialed is unavailable. Xiao Yang, where's Mr. Fu? Hello? Miss Fu, Mr. Fu just went to Country A on business. Well, he has on the plane, so he might miss your call. When will he come back? Has he signed a divorce agreement? Miss Fu, Miss Fu, hello. The signal is very weak here. I I hang up now. I can't get in touch with Fu Tingshen. He hasn't signed the divorce agreement yet. I can send a lawyer's letter for you. But he went abroad. You didn't expect Fu Tingshen is a coward. Mr. Fu, Miss Fu sent the lawyer's letter to the company. Moreover, Miss Fu has joined the Shen Shi Group. What? Shen Hao hired her as their legal counsel. We go back now. Oh, uh, I've got news of Fu Tingshen. We get off the plane in an hour. I will go there now. Oh, uh, shall I give you a ride? No. Don't you have a client meeting later? I can go by myself. Oh, uh, we still don't have a chance to be with you, right? Zhenxiong, what do you think we should do now? May she has been convicted. It's all because of that bitch. Ning Wan, we hired her mother as a maid. I didn't expect that she'd repay our Qing family like this. She's such an ungrateful person. That's enough. I'm annoyed too. If Fu Tingshan doesn't invest in the Qing group, he can't even run it anymore. Ning Wan, the damned girl. She's really killing our family. I really can't stand it. We must avenge Macy. Darling, come in here. Ning Wan, that bitch. I want her dad. Fu Tingshen, do you have any questions about the terms of the divorce agreement? There's no problem with the terms, but Ning Wan, I never agreed to a divorce. I never cheated on you. Qin Meishi's child is not mine. Wang Wang, I love you. I know I've made a lot of mistakes and hurt you. Can you give me a chance to make it up to you? I've spent my whole life to pay you back. But you should. It's too late. Tishan, Tishan, how are you? Tishan. Well, I finally have a chance to save your life. Tishan, hold on, I call an ambulance for you right now. Thank <laughs> you.
Xiao Lian, are you blind? I told you to hit that bitch new one. How dare you hit Fu Dizheng? Are you trying to get me killed? Mr. Zhu, I did hit new one. But who knew that Fu Dizheng would suddenly come out? I can't stop for a moment, so I... Mr. Zhu. How dare you come here? How dare you come here? <laughs> Qing Jianshen, my mom has worked as a maid for your Qing family for over 20 years and I have been helping out since I was a child. Why are you doing this to me? Bitch, you robbed Fu Tingshen and put me in jail. It's not enough for you to die! Kyo, you have come to me so I don't have to fight you. Go and catch her. Let me go, let me go! What do you want? You have ruined Macy's life. What do you think I want to do? Of course, a life for life. Let me go, let me go! Just let me out, let me out. Quotation, you will be fine, right? Mr. Fu, you're awake! Where is Ningua? Mr. Fu, Ms. Fu brought you to the emergency room just now. Then she went out. And didn't come back. Hello. The phone you have there is part of. Mr. Fu, I've got the information. Miss Fu disappeared after she went to the Qing family. Mr. Fu, you're seriously injured. Ningwa is in trouble. Mr. Fu, you're seriously injured. Mr. Mr. Fu, it's so late. Why are you here? Where's my wife? Mr. Fu, it's so late. Why are you here? Where's my wife? Mr. Fu, what are you talking about? How could new one be here with us? If you want to fight your wife, you should go home. Why are you here? I will ask one more time. Where's Ningwan? I... We really don't know. Hey! Stop him! Petition, is that you? Petition. Sorry, I'm late. Shouldn't you be in the hospital? You're in trouble. Do you really think I can stand aside? Ting Shen, I heard it this morning. Ting Jian Sheng sent someone to hit me. Ting Jian Sheng, you'd better turn yourself in now. Otherwise, 
Don't blame me for taking action against the Chinmu. How dare you? Fujita! You ruined our Meishi's life. She was your savior. You... You're biting the hand that feeds you! For Ching Meishi's favor. I've already repaid her in full a few years ago. She's the one who hurt my wife over and over again. She deserved it. You... You... In that case, as for Ching family, you should put your best into it. Ting Sheng, is the wound serious? Just a small wound. What? Do you know how badly you were hurt in the car accident you took for me yesterday? You... you really scare me. Wawa, you do care about me. Do you still love me? I... How can you young guys dare to act like this? You secretly leave the hospital with a serious wound. If the wound opens up, it will be inflamed. You must take care of yourself. Okay, doctor. I got it. I'll take care of him. Okay. Ting Shen, are you really going to tackle the Qing group? When did I tell lies? But the Qing group has a strong base. It's not easy for you to tackle them. Miss Fu, I'm very happy that you worry about me so much. Who cares about you? You are self-sentimental. Don't worry. Since they dare to bully you, I must make them pay a price. Stop! I'm sure Sheng Hao calls me for public matters. Are you with Fu Tingshen? Yes. It seems you're back together. I didn't promise him. For you, he even dares to die. I'm inferior to him, really. Mr. Sheng, Ningwa has asked for leave. Please don't harass her. Hello? Fu Tingshen, you... Ningwa, now you dare to flirt with other men right in front of me. You talk nonsense. He's my friend, and he's my boss. You go back to resign tomorrow. That's impossible, Fu Tingsheng. You cannot interfere in my work. I'm gonna go against you. If you want to work, you must come to the food group. No, I do not wish to see you on and off duty. Niwa, so you agree not to divorce me? Nope. I... Mr. Sheng, you look for me. Niwa, this is your letter of termination. What? You want to fire me? Is it because of attention? Of course not. I'm going to leave Nan City. In fact, the Sheng family have settled down overseas. This time I come back to pursue you. But now it seems I failed. <laughs> In fact, I know that. You cannot give up Fu Tingshen. I also saw how he had that car accident for saving you that time. Though I still do not like him, I can tell that he loves you sincerely. How? Then I can only accept the fact that I'm dismissed. Okay, wish you everything goes well and is carefree in the future. Niwa, the same to you. You're always an excellent girl. Don't downgrade yourself. I believe in you. You must be able to become a good lawyer. I'm leaving now. Can I hug you? Sheng Hao, let go of her. Okay. May you be happy. You still can't bear to let him go? You are so insubordinate. I told you to stay in the hospital. But you are here dating with others. I said that I'm working. Don't be jealous. I can't, Niwan. I love you so much. I have no sense of security when I can't see you. 
Cut it out, physician. I didn't know you were so cheesy before. Because I'm really afraid you will leave me. I have decided not to divorce, so I will not leave you. Mr. Fu, I beg you, I beg you, please help Jiu Shou. Mei Xi has been imprisoned. I will lose my world if Jiu Shou is also arrested. It's too late to beg me now. Mr. Fu, I beg you, please. Qin Jianshan embezzled public money. That's the fact. I have no idea of how to save a criminal. I know you can. I beg you. I know you can save him, Mr. Fu. Drag her out. I beg you. I know you can save him, Mr. Fu. I beg you, Mr. Fu. What have you done? I just gave his evidence corruption to policemen. But I didn't expect it that he was so vulnerable. The police convicted him soon after receiving the evidence. Let's go to the shopping mall. Buy what? Our wedding rings. Miss, you really have a good taste. This is the new product of this brand. It is called True Love. Tishan, look, it's so beautiful. I'll take it. Miss, you are so blissful. Your husband is rich and handsome. What a perfect man! Please wait a minute. I'll pack it for you. What's wrong? Tishan, I didn't get my period last month, and I feel nauseous now. What do you mean? I wonder. Maybe I'm pregnant. Wawa, you you mean I will be a daddy? Be careful. I will taste it after getting home. Okay. Take care of our baby. Here you are. Looking for a cheer coming next time. Tishan, if I am pregnant, which do you prefer, a boy or a girl? I like both. But the one who I love the most is you.